What's up, y'all? We got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. First of all, um, we about to get into Jaden and Krishan and Blueface Child because apparently Jaden posted something a year ago that did not age well. And I I skipped the intro. It's a lot. It's a lot of music in uh this person's intro, but shout out to Dimples T. Okay. Let's get into it. Throwing a little shade at Krishan and Boo Chow. They was eating her up in the comments. OMG. I'm gonna let y'all take a look right quick, then I'll be back. Why you and your man having a conversation about me in y'all bed while y'all in the bed? A year ago today. So she recently posted this. So she is pregnant in that video. But sis, you was the one who been talking about Krishan in the bed. Am I lying? That's to Krishan def defense as well. Like, what? What was the reason? First of all, why are you and your man having a conversation about me in your bed while y'all in the bed? First of all, Jay that don't make sense. <laughs> what? Not they go live every day and talk about Krishan every day. Like, as much as they talk on camera, y'all know off camera, they got her name all in their mouth. Jaden made that TikTok back when um she was pregnant with the daughter and her and Krishan was beefing hard about Blueface. Basically, she was saying that Krishan is obsessed and she be in the bed talking about her to Blueface. So now people thinking Jaden trying to be shady once again by sharing that TikTok. Okay, y'all, right here, somebody come. Unless they in the bed. We ain't seen Krishan or Blueface in the bed recently. He said and said, wait, what? You and Blue had a full-blown interview about Krishan. Literally. This other one said, you are the main turned side chick back to main because the side chick turned main. Nah, nah. You were the main turned side chick back to main because the side chick turned main left. Girl, this is not a flex. I like this person. Chrissy Ben Barbie. She know how to word a word. Left. Girl, this not a flex. Shut up. This one here said, I mean, Krishan made a name for herself with the drama Blue Carry. You just there ain't doing nothing. This one said, the main piece became the side piece back to the main piece. Chow. <laughs> this coming here had me rolling because they stupid. It said, they both on this girl so hard. I know that coochie good. La Got to be. Got to be. But I feel like. Uh, Blueface is the one who be starting all this bullshit. Last one here said, I wonder how far their career can go without mentioning Krishan. Like, I really want them to try it out. To be honest, they not gonna do that no time soon, especially Blueface. Any chance he get, yeah, he gonna talk that junk about Krishan. And Jaden just be doing anything Blueface do, so she gonna be right behind him. And based on yeah, what's going on now, that TikTok is actually... Jaden is like a shadow. When it comes to Blueface, because she does just a, like a little tape recorder, just repeat everything he's saying. She look crazy as hell with that chain on right there. Oh, I ain't even gonna lie. That look kind of crazy. Kind of funny, because now her and Blueface are in the bed together talking about Krishan. Now Krishan doing her thing. She ain't paying them no mind, but they steady talking about her. But I'm not gonna lie though. That love triangle thing they got going on is a mess and i'm sure a lot of y'all would agree but y'all go ahead comment down below and tell me what y'all think about this situation Cha. oh money bag yo went and got ari's thing tatted behind his ear and i know some of y'all wondering how they spotted that i don't know but y'all know the internet they always gonna peep Child, money bag, love, all right. But some ish. Literally, and put two and two together and figure it out, even though sometimes... They look the fuck good together, like, though. how? I ain't even gonna lie. Like, they look at them. That baby is gonna be gorgeous whenever they decide. But I ain't gonna lie, bro got a lot of kids. Let me ask y'all a question. Do y'all think she's taking part in raising those kids? If not, right, do you think it's an issue with that when you marry a person? He ain't, they ain't married yet, but... When you decide to marry a person and you don't really have no part in their kid's life. And granted, hold on, because I don't know if she got part in their life. I'm just saying, I'm asking a question. You know, how would y'all feel? Like, would you be able to date a man who 
has the amount of kids that he has, which is like five or more. And um, would you want to take part in the raising? Or, or like, would you just be cool with the baby mama raising and doing her thing and his children ain't none of your damn business? She's not, and yes, it's a problem. I think she may when they come around. Hmm. Yeah, in this situation, if I were her, I would let him handle his own goddamn children simply because he has so many. Um, and a lot of them are older. So her coming in, you know, to the parenting ship, I just think that that's a lot. But if she does it, that's amazing. Like if she's taking part in a life, because 555 in the chat, because I feel like he's definitely taking part in um, her little baby life. So. You know, y'all let me know what y'all think. I just want to know. What made you do that? Like, literally, how? But child, it gets it done. But anyways, some people think Moneybag Yo is full of it for getting Ari's name tatted after doing all that cheating. So right here, someone said, oh, this cheated. don't mean nothing if you keep cheating. Someone else said, don't get my name tatted just to be moving single. This one here said, that don't mean nothing. They still gonna dog you out. Right here, one person said, after all that cheating, that ish wouldn't mean nothing to me. Be then someone else said, Tats. Being Ari getting cheated on by money bag would have me cheating on him with, like, the baby. Like, if if you want to play that game, I we're going to have to play it. Because I you done disrespected me. And at this point, I feel very disrespected, so... Money bag smash on some random chick. Bet. Okay, now I gotta guy I gotta like fuck yo Gotti or something. <laughs> like, nigga. I just I don't know. I feel like women are crazy if you think I seen a post the other day speaking about that. Like women are crazy if they I think it was TI daughter. Women are crazy if you think a man not cheating on you, basically. Twos don't eradicate monthly cheating. Looks cute though. I get what people are saying. It took for him to mess up, then she stayed. Then now he wanna go and get something stamped. To me, I think some people do that to try and prove some type of loyalty, but you already proved that you wasn't loyal, so yeah. It's so backwards, but I guess it makes sense in their heads. But y'all comment down below, tell me what y'all think about Moneybag Yo tattooing Ari's name. Let me- I don't know, women can get over shit good. Well, not good, but like, Way faster than a man when it come to cheating. Um, and I also feel like niggas are full of shit when they say it ain't nothing but some pussy. Because if that pussy good, you gonna fuck her again. You know? I think that that's, I think that that's bullshit. However, I could definitely fuck somebody right now and act like I never did it. Right after it happened. Um, but, I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, but yeah, Jaden kind of asked for this today. And, um, or whenever she posted it, when was this video? One day ago. So probably a couple days ago. But yeah, y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.